dear students, never had I imagined that we will experience in our lifetimes trying times like this. At this time in the world is covered, enveloped with darkness, fear, and uncertainty. Let us draw inspiration from the words of the late civil rights leader, Julian Bond. The pessimist looks out from his corner to the world and bewails the present state of affairs and predicts woeful things about the future. In every cloud, he beholds a destructive storm. In every flash of lightning, an omen of evil. And in every shadow that falls across his path, a lurking foe. He forgets that the clouds also bring life and hope, that lightning purifies the atmosphere, that shadow and darkness prepare for sunshine and growth, and that hardships and adversity nerve the race as the individual for greater efforts and grander victories. In the case of the Holy Angel University community, your graduation is our light and hope. Graduation during this pandemic truly inspires optimism and faith in the promise of a stronger and brighter tomorrow. This hope comes not only from knowing that we have imparted sound knowledge and good values in our students, but also in knowing that you have given your best to achieve your goals. Had this been your actual graduation ceremony, you would be hearing our strings quartet play a movement from Beethoven's Ninth Symphony entitled Ode to Joy. The story behind Ode to Joy is of great relevance to this occasion, especially in light of our global pandemic. Throughout his career, Ludwig van Beethoven was a child of the Enlightenment era and a fervent believer of the Enlightenment values of brotherhood and freedom. For his ninth and last symphony, Beethoven returned to a lengthy poem by Friedrich Schiller that he had long waited to set to music, but for which he had never managed to find the right mode of expression. And that poem is Ode to Joy. Schiller's poetry states that in a new world, the new ways will no longer divide people and that all men shall become brothers. That we are all sisters and brothers is indeed one of the lessons that the pandemic has reinforced. At no other time have we truly learned that the actions of one would affect the welfare of others. I pray that we are currently experiencing something that has enlightened you not only about the kind of future you want for yourselves but also about the kind of future we wish for others that you are capable and willing to be nation builders agents of change and catalysts of progress to create a future that is true good and beautiful for all humanity is waiting to unfold. Allow this uncertainty to define your purpose and to create your best possible self. May this experience renew your commitment as angelites to serve and help others. You now have a mission to set this world into the life of brotherhood and stewardship. That your competence in your chosen fields may provide solutions to our unanswered questions. That your compassionate hearts bring comfort and solace to our brothers and sisters in need. And that your conscientious souls enlighten the path of people you encounter along the way. Infect loved ones and strangers alike with your gifts of good conscience, competence, and compassion so that others may return and believe in God through your good work. This may be the antidote to remedy our sick world. I feel sorry to not having the opportunity 
to personally shake your hands and congratulate you at this time. But please know that we are proud of what you have accomplished and who you have become. Please rest assured that we are planning to have a traditional university commencement ceremony for you. And as we celebrate this milestone in the comfort of our homes, it is my hope that the gift of solitude brings you the peace, love, and faith in our Creator. Soon, you will once again see the outside world, but this time with renewed hope. So on behalf of the Holy Angel University community, our sincerest congratulations to you, the class of 2020. Laos Deo Semper. So big 
And everything seems so out of reach The sky is high And the walk is wide You just don't know what you've got yet It's in the palm of your hands It's right in front of where you stand
we seize the night tonight we own the night tonight we own the night
I've never been the one to raise my hand. That was not me, and now that's who I am because of you. I am standing tall. My heart. Is all I need to know. I've learned to love myself in spite of me, and I've learned to walk the road that I believe. But the only question with me now is, do I make you proud?
yes I am I've made it I'm that little bit of old man When my back's against the wall I can feel the world's greatest And I saw the light and I'm that star up in the sky I'm that mountain beaver I'm that pot of gold At the end of the rainbow I'm the world's greatest Now I can just walk on the world's greatest And it's the greatest Woo. Can you feel it? Say the greatest, yeah Can you feel it? Yeah Now yeah. yeah. I'm so the light At the end of the tunnel But he's in the pot of gold At the end of the rainbow
Ain't too sure what I believe in But I believe in what I see And when I close my eyes I see my whole life ahead of me These are There's a spark in 